More breaking update coming in and ahead of polls. Divisive politics peaks in Uttar Pradesh. Now, statement by Yogi's Minister Baldev Singh Olak has triggered a row. When asked to comment on AIMIM Neta urging Muslims to produce more children to make OYC the Prime Minister, Baldev Singh Olak, the State Minister for Jal Shakti, said, and I quote, Muslim community only knows how to produce children. Who can stop them? They only eat and drink and produce children. Education, etc. has never been their priority, unquote. तो बच्चे पैदा तो पहले से ही वो कर रहे हैं उनको रोक कौन रहा है उनका खाना पीना और उसके बाद बच्चे पैदा करना उनकी सोच नहीं है कि, कि हमारे बच्चे की अच्छी जगह पढ़े उनकी सोच नहीं कि हमारे बच्चे तरक्की करें I'm joined by my colleague Amir over this Amir we have in fact seen uh, that uh, of course there's a lot of uh, attention in Uttar Pradesh ahead of polls next year but this is the kind of politics which unfortunately mars the polling process ahead every time we see uh, an election approaching in Uttar Pradesh now a very very divisive statement being made by one of the ministers in yogi government absolutely and uh, this uh, is not coming from uh, just about any neta of the ruling party the bharatiya janata party but this is coming in from a minister a uh, cabinet minister uh, who should have actually been much more responsible in giving out uh, uh, statements like these. And obviously, the kind of uh, statement that uh, the MIM leader from Aligarh gave uh, in terms of uh, urging the Muslim community to produce more children so that uh, Asuddin Uwesi, the chief of the party, can actually be made a prime minister, that definitely was also very deplorable. And uh, we, we've covered uh, uh, that story as well. Uh, but uh, a minister of uh, the UP cabinet to be reacting to this statement in this manner, uh, condemning directly uh, the entire uh, Muslim community, making such sweeping uh, remarks against uh, one particular community trying to target it, is something which is absolutely very, very condemnable. And it clearly smacks of uh, divisive politics uh, ahead of uh, the 2022 uh, assembly polls. Uh, uh, because we've seen in the past as well, uh, leaders from both sides, from the ruling ruling party as well as uh, the opposition, uh, uh, you know, uh, kind of uh, 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 taking to tactics uh, to polarize uh, the polity ahead of the assembly elections in order to uh, achieve a better uh, vote bank for uh, their respective parties. That definitely also needs, uh, uh, needs to be condoned. But uh, clearly, this coming in from a state minister is very, very condemnable. And uh, perhaps seniors from within the party should be, uh, uh, you know, making such noises uh, that uh, this is not acceptable. This should not happen, uh, especially around the polls when uh, uh, people should actually be talking over the issues of development, of uh, implementation of government schemes, uh, developmental schemes. All of that should be a subject of uh, discussion, but not definitely polarizing issues like these. Amir, this is, of course, a very, very shocking comment which is coming in from uh, the minister there in Uttar Pradesh government. We'll, of course, have to wait and see what reactions which come out of it, including that of Yogi Adityanath. Thank you so much for joining us with that.